Ancient human relatives buried their dead in caves, new theory claims. Homo nalidi, despite having tiny brains, may have lit fires and decorated walls around the graves of their dead, according to controversial new research. More than 1,500 remains of a rare type of prehistoric hominid were found in a South African cave in 2015, shocking experts with their discovery. The animals, known as Homo nalidi, had tiny bodies, long arms, bent fingers, and brains that were around one-third the size of those of contemporary people. They existed at a time when the earliest people were roving over Africa. The same team of researchers is now announcing a new, shocking discovery after years of study of the elaborate underground cave surfaces and sediments, the Homo nalidi, despite having little brains, buried their dead in graves. The burials were marked with inscriptions on the cave walls, and they lit torches to light their way down. Lee Berger, a paleoanthropologist at the University of Witwatersrand in Johannesburg and the leader of the project, said that the discovery that a small-brained hominid did such human-like things was profound. It suggests that big brains are not essential for sophisticated kinds of thinking, he said, such as making symbols, cooperating on dangerous expeditions or even recognizing death. But a number of experts on ancient engravings and burials said that the evidence did not yet support these extraordinary conclusions about Homo nalidi. The cave evidence found so far could have a range of other explanations, they said. The skeletons might have been merely left on the cave floor, for example. And the charcoal and engravings found in the cave might have been left by modern humans who entered long after Homo nalidi became extinct. Two South African cavers excavating the Rising Star Cave came across the Homo nalidi fossils in 2013, Dr. Berger planned an excursion into the intricate network of chambers and tunnels that is miles deep.